With Storm Team 2 meteorologist Cameron Saliga with the Miami Valley's certified most accurate forecast. What's also gorgeous is the outside here as we uh, go through the late afternoon hours heading into the evening. It is a beautiful day to get outside and enjoy those cool temperatures. Yet again, we had those temperatures in the 70s yesterday and for some of us today staying in those 70s. We do have a few 80s around the Miami Valley, but you can see the mostly sunny skies on the Jeff Schmidt Auto Group camera there over uh, 35 in Beaver Creek. It's uh, a OK to get outside. You do need the shade, though. So as you head outdoors. Precip chances over the next 12 hours, they are non-existent. We're going to have another night with mostly clear skies, and it will be a uh, pretty quiet one here as we go through the overnight hours and as we go through the weekend, mostly sunny skies as we go through your Saturday. Sunday, we'll add some cloud cover out there. We'll add a degree as well, 85 degrees for your high here as we go throughout the weekend, so pretty close to the normal for uh, this time of year and uh, temperatures here as we go through the daytime tomorrow down to the south. That's where it will be the warmest, but we all get into the 80s here going through the daytime up to the north. 81 in those northern counties and further south right around 84 degrees potentially could get up to 85 in some of those southern counties. Live Doppler 2 HD all quiet here going through the four o'clock hour. You do see some green, but that's not rain again. That is on live Doppler 2 HD. Zooming out, high pressure dominates the Great Lakes region. You see some storms further off to the west. That cold front still off to the east. They're seeing some storms down to the south and east. They're actually going to have the system set up over there uh, here over the next couple of days. So they're going to receive chances of storms here for the next couple of days while we do see some sunshine thanks to that high pressure system in the region. Temperatures right now up to the north in those 70s, 76, 77 degrees in Minster and Wapkineta. Some areas in the 80s, places like Troy and Springboro at 82 and 80, but here in Dayton sitting at 78 degrees. We'll see if we get to that 80 degree mark by the uh, end of the daytime. Future track here going through the overnight hours will be mostly clear, maybe a few passing clouds as we go through the nighttime, but looking to stay mostly clear. And that is the case here as we go through the daytime tomorrow. Lots of sunshine in the forecast here going into the afternoon. We could see just a few clouds as we get into the uh, two, three, four o'clock time frame. And we'll add those clouds going into Sunday, becoming more partly cloudy. Could even see some times with mostly cloudy skies to end the weekend off. So tonight we drop down to 58 degrees. We'll be mostly clear. It will be a quiet night. Northeast winds at zero to eight miles per hour. Then in the daytime tomorrow, 84 degrees, mostly sunny. Beautiful day to get outside. Again, dew points, not too bad. In the mid 50s, up to 60 degrees through your Saturday. So not too humid to get outside and uh, enjoy the weekend because we'll have chances of storms as we go into the work week. Monday, there's a small chance that's when the uh, temperatures actually get their highest 86 degrees. And then as we head into Tuesday and through the rest of the week, there will be chances of storms with temperatures getting down to 80 on Wednesday.